Hello there, Skelechi Amadi, Century 21 People's Choice Realty, weeklyhome-picks.com. I'm back again. It's been about three weeks right now. I traveled and I'm back from my trip. It was a success. Uh, I really appreciate you for taking time to take a look at this video. And we're back and this is the last month of the year for 2012. So we have a few properties here today. I would like us to take a look at the power of sale properties, about five of them. So we're going to begin with 250 John Gallard uh, Bolivar, Unit 107. It's a condo townhouse at the Finch and Matting Grove area. Uh, it's going for 125000 Now remember the maintenance fees on the high side is 513 dollars uh, and it doesn't cover everything so it's important to notice that but it's a good uh, property to take a look at for rental purposes or even for a first time buyer looking to unit it's 250 John Gallard Oliver unit 107 going for 125,000 the next property is at the Eggslinton and Elmhurst area 83 Iwin Road, Unit 23. It's going for 177,900. Uh, Toronto TD Bank is selling this one. You can see the pictures in there that it looks presentable. Might need some really little touch up, but it's a good looking property. And you have only two bedrooms, one washroom. Maintenance fee is 409. It covers uh, your water, your building insurance, common elements, and then uh, you have to pay the other stuff. You have a parking space and that's about it. So 177900 for a condo townhouse, two bedroom, one washroom. The next one is in Brampton. This is 11 Merton Road. You need, uh, well, this is not a unit, it's a semi detached back split uh, property. Very, um, in terms of rental possibilities, is very good for that. 279900 you're looking at four plus one bedrooms, three washrooms. And uh, kitchens here, one plus one, and the, right now it's a tenant in the property, so definitely worth a look at uh, in Brampton, Kennedy and Lingdale area, 11 Merton Road. The next one is in also actually in the Peel region area, so Mississauga, 3322 Chipley Crescent, it's going for 299900 and uh, you're looking at the Morning Star Galway area. It's a semi-detached, two-story, four plus one bedroom, um, two washrooms, vacant, ready to go. Let's take a look at the pictures inside to see how it looks. Uh, it might need some work, but it looks okay, presentable. Definitely worth a look at. The next property is in Brampton, number 148 Sun Forest Drive. It's a detached home, a good starter home for those you know, looking to move in themselves. Three bedrooms, two washrooms, 148 Sun Forest Drive, going for 325000 for sale by the Royal Bank of Canada. Um, definitely uh, worth a look at. The last or the next property uh, is at Toronto, 3322 Battles Street, going for 333900 in Battles and Lawrence area. The pictures here, two bedrooms plus one. And uh, basically, I know you see the pictures, you definitely need to do some work. Two bedroom plus one. Um, you have only one washroom though. And uh, basically, the last one is in. Oh no, not the last one. This is almost the last one. Uh, we're looking at in Toronto area also. 117 Slan Avenue. It's going for 344. 344,000 and you're looking at three plus two bedrooms uh, it's a bungalow detached bungalow might need some work definitely need some touch-up but looks good and uh, in the Ellesmere and Scarborough Golf area CIBC selling this property the last one but not the least is 58 Bush Mills Square in the Finch and Midland area, that's the Scarborough area, kind of 459,000. I don't know why it's this high because it's a semi detached, but definitely the area must be 
probably good or um, something there but funny enough it's a grow up a former grow up so I don't know why it's this high however if you're interested in any of these properties please call me at 416-275-4408 or email me and then we can make something happen thank you for checking out the video have yourself a great week and have a good one